Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 6 of Lots of Giants. Last episode, did some more world exploring, got a bunch of charcoal working on my crockpots, because crockpots, oh freaking pee, I need them in my life. Got myself a flipping walking cane from a set piece. It was just laying there in the open, just begging to be, just, just like, pick me up, pick me up. So I totes did. Mapped out some wormholes, and now I need to begin working on the base a bit more because I don't like it at all. I don't like where it's at for the time in this world. I have a very bad feeling about this. <laughs> I can do my top hat now. I can start working on the press the hatitator. That at least is good in its own right. So now, drying rack is now what I need to make. Uh, I need to get my cut stone, which I have right here. Extra rocks. Let's be. Fine. There we go. Crockpot. Okay, that book gone. Crockpot. Right there. And again, I need more cut stone. So let's just refine the cut stone real fast. We'll need quite a bit. And then, you, you know what? Before I actually make a bajillion crockpots, six is what I need for this. And I need to make two doodads. Yes, there's two doodads on the floor, but they're for something else there, and then I also need Niter, which apparently I haven't been picking up my just, do my what? What's wrong with me? I could have swore I picked up Niter. That's okay, there's plenty of rocks right here. But, um, unless the Moleworm came by and got it. But let me go get the Niter. And we'll make ourselves not only the Endothermic Fire, but the Endothermic Fire Pit is what's important right now. So let's take care of that. Give me my niter. Plus, I'll need more cut stone. I'm going to make quite a few things here. Uh, the water is becoming a concern, but I should be fine. I'll be going back to the fire here shortly. Gotta cook up my green caps anyway, get my sanity back up. All the, all the wormholes ripped my sanity quite a bit. So we're at three niter. Let's just finish all of these rocks. Ooh, delicious wet goop. Oh, no, no. It's not, it's not wet goop. It's very wet goop. Oh, no, 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 this won't do at all. <laughs> yeah, it's probably not something you want to eat. I'm not WX game. That never happened as WX. I never got random lightning strikes unless I forced them. Yet, as Wicker, I get them. As the not lightning rod, I attract lightning. My RNG is just poop, says the guy with the walking cane. It's okay, we're soaked, I know. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to get as much of this as I can real fast before I get back. Go, 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 go. Take care of this. This is one ridiculous rain, but it's spring. So, we knew that was coming. Okay. And there's another one right there. It's, it's a gold rock, yeah. There's two of them. Screw it. I'll put the endos right there somewhere. We'll fight D-Fly out here. Not near base, and this is like a place that you come to base from, rather than having to lure D-Fly through base, which I don't want to do. I wanted to mine this before night hit. Thank you. <laughs> Chester. Chester does that quite often. He gets struck by lightning. I'm not even surprised. Go, 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 go. Aww, I gotta make me waste my torch for a couple seconds to get to my campfire. My fire pit. Is that what you're gonna make me do, game? Thanks. Alright, let's dry off. And use up some of these green caps. Fix our sanity, and we can start whipping things up in the crock pot, which is fantastic. Yeah, let's see where that gets us. Looking way better. But let's do a few more. That will be good. Alright, so I want to make myself. Oops. Do I have to do that? No, I left them on the ground. Give me them doodads. There. That's important to have pre-crafted. In fact, let's get a couple more cut stone going. Six to be exact. Honestly, I should have another one pre-crafted. I'll tell you what. Not what I want to do with all my rocks, but I feel as if it's a worthwhile endeavor. Then I'll make four doodads total. I have a bunch of extra gold on Chester. I don't feel bad about that at all. There we are, and I have all the stuff I need. Cool. So I'll go place one of those on the ground. Now, for the crock pot, let's do this. Just make me balls. Eat one of these before they go bad. 
Unfortunately, it doesn't last too long. And I'll go place down my fires. Get that over and done with. Grass twigs, let's keep that going. I've not even slapped my chest down, you know? Just, just not cool. Not cool, man. Let's also do the top hat. Put that on the ground. So that's going to be the crystal habitator, which I already have the cords for, which means I don't need the silk. And all I need to do is go get my bunnies. So we can also go capture the bunny rabbits. But let's go take care of D-Fly Arena. And also free up some inventory slots. I do not need to carry this book with me. I'll come back and I'll do the rest of our crock pots too. Nice. So D-Fly, your little thing will be right here. Along the road, I like, yeah. Just like right, right along the road would be cool. So first fire down. Second fire. Again, line it up and then just use control. Get as close as I can. There. That should be close enough. Now you have the second one pre-crafted, which is great. Very useful. Alright, so twigs will be used quite heavily here for the crock pots, but it's a necessity, I feel. Absolute necessity. Day 17, and I'll have summer prep ready. Feels bad, man. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's, let's refine. Let's do this. Three per, so let's keep going. Stop at nine. Okay, the hammer is in the way. Okay, the rain's let up. That's nice. Recraft you. Pick that up. Drop. Nice. Get out of the way. There you go. Last but not least, this one. I think Chester is going to be in the way. Chester. Okay, you're not. Actually, fuck that up. No, 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 it's just Chester is still in the way. No, now the bird's in the way. <laughs> God damn it, game. Stop throwing everything. Nope, no, that was absolutely perfect. Don't you sass me. Don't you fucking sass me. I hate when it does that. Build a crock pot. And then you gotta, you gotta right click and nothing happens. Oh my god, you son of a bitch. Have it your way, motherfucker. I ain't gonna worry about it. We'll come back and do that shit later. I'm gonna go get my Prestahatitator up right now, and then make my uh, my gem, or my, my chill diamond with that gem we have, so I can feel very confident about summer. Nearest rabbit hole where? <laughs> Ain't that a bitch? Nowhere really. Uh, wow. Let's test his inventory before we leave. Drop the boards off. Hey, this is such a clusterfuck. I just feel like. I'm not where I need to be. I'll make two chests. Uh, let's examine you. Okay, that is fine. We'll put our chest up there then. There then. And rocks. Rock related things. Chester. There you go, man. Awesome, awesome. And that other chest. Let's actually place it this time. Cool. Okay, I don't need to carry that many with me. I'm gonna start going bad though. Shoot. Let's eat the meatballs. And we'll do a couple sets of meatballs here. Take that with me on the road. Could start using the book, make a grass and twig chest. Um, rip sanity, but again, good use of green caps. And we can eat a bunch of berries back. But now I gotta go make the prestahatitator, which really sucks considering I don't really have any close by bunnies. Not at all. I have not gotten the other ice, but I don't think I want to worry about the second Fuego. I, I, I don't think I have to concern myself really about it at all at this point. It's 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 down to let's just go get ourselves what we really need, and that's a, a, a chilled amulet. Or at least what would be really nice. So this will be the grass and twig chest. We'll start storing excess in there. This will be the rock chest. Start storing that crap there. Uh, that. I'm just going to put it in here because it's a burnable. And it's, there you go. Nice. And let's just go do it. So, let's go find ourselves some bunny wabbits. Take care of that. Uh, continue to do a little bit of exploring while we still have time. But there's our double endo, so we have a guaranteed spot to fight D-Fly. 
Uh, I have not had a chance to make the tentacle book yet, but I think I actually have all the ingredients. I have a single tentacle spot, and I think it's only one that goes into it. If I'm not mistaken, it should only be one. Give the extra gold to Chester. And then what I would like to do, it's not going to work with Berger, but it'll work kind of well with Deerclops. Use tentacle books against them <laughs> the for fun. For fun, but let's go explore. I need to get this done. Get some more rocks. We will need them for the niter. We will also need the rocks for our crockpots. Gimme, gimme. No, no, space bar, do your thing. Thank you. Thank you. Back to that cane. Alright, so my best guess for some nearby bunnies would be over here in this little patch of savannah, but I don't recall, I don't remember for certain. As long as there's four, because again, we'll do the. We'll dig them up. We'll dig them out. We'll dig their, their rabbit holes, force them out. One, two, okay, so we're, we're good. As long as Chester doesn't inconvenience me too much here, we will be fine. That'll be all the bunnies we require. There you go. Chester, hang on to that, and that, and that. And give me my trap back, buddy. Okay, so you can go right there. Chester, don't don't spook him, don't spook him. Oh, you sick, twisted son of a bitch. <laughs> no, 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 you don't. No, no, no. You, you go that way. That That's a good bunny wabbit. Good bunny wabbit. Good bunny wabbit. Alright, it's night. Uh, I do still have a torch. We'll, you, we'll piss away that torch just to get it out of my inventory. Okay. Chester, quit trying to spook the bunnies. There you go. And the last one right there. Nice. So, as soon as this torch goes, we can use the lantern. But there's the bunny. So, actually, I mean, we could just go straight back home, make this now, and even get the, the, the amulet ready to go. I wouldn't mind that, knowing how to have it made. And plus, this obviously gets me closer towards Dark Swords. Once I start getting myself the nightmare fuel, I don't really need to even lug this around at all. But uh, yeah, we also have to go do a light bulb run, or I could do my. Oh, you know, we could do that too. We have the extra silk. I could make the bug net. I could make the miner hat, and I could also fuel my lantern. As big of a waste as it is, or we could go down to the cave that's right next to base and hope to God that we get some light bulbs close by. That's a big hope. Um. <laughs> It could be right there, it couldn't be, who knows, we'll see, we'll see. First things first, let's let's just use these bunnies before they start starving to death. Because, I mean, I'm not cruel or anything. I'm totally nice. <laughs> I love Mother Nature. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Anyway, I don't want to waste this lantern any more than I have to. Okay. Press the habitator just needs the boards. Okay, hands. Don't like all of you guys come after me at once or anything. Jeez. Jerks. Alright, press the habitator hype. Make sure you are within radius. And I'll just put you up there. Works for me. Alright, so it's three gold and the blue gem, and that's all we need. And that's the amulet. And that takes care of summer easy peasy. Of course, there's a thermal stone. Which, in fact, I should have enough stone, I think, in Chester. Yeah, let's do that. And I would not mind a second one, so we can alternate between the two. So we'll make that pickaxe. Put you in there. I can go mine and then drop that off. Uh, the green caps, no point yet. I'll craft this into it once I mine up a wee bit. But let's go explore now, I think. I'm not going to craft the thermal stone. Oh, I guess I could. I'll craft the thermal stone and I'll give it to Chester. Because, you know, he doesn't overheat or anything. The, the, the stone won't bother him. He will not suddenly combust or start dying of <laughs> a frozen death like I would if I had a thermal stone, depending which season. He's Chester. He's, he's something special. Yeah, meatballs. Dope. You and you and you. More niter is always welcome. 
All right, we're coming down to the grind here. Two, two or three days. And also, remember, we have the grace period, so there's there's that. We don't have to be uh, constantly babysitting that fling out. But uh, really, what I'm worried about is my person. Well, I have a chill day, but I'm not worried anymore. But I need I need resistance to that. I need heat resistance. I don't have an umbrella, and an umbrella is meh. Thermal stone I can totally get away with, but I, I definitely prefer the other one. Pickaxe is at nine percent. I can swing up. I can swing twice here. Okay. Extra thermal. Clears up the inventory. I ain't going to that, bud. All right. So I'm gonna go explore now. Should have dropped those boards off. Should have dropped those boards off. Do I have that axe? It's at 39. I can chop a few big trees and stump them. I'll free up some inventory too. This will waste 15% and this will waste that shovel. Yeah! Let's make some room. There we go. Nice. Pine cones, sure. Might as well keep the trees going, right? So we have something to come back to later. One tree into two. I'm doing Mother Nature a favor. Alright, so what do we have down here? If this leads to that rocky biome, I will be a happy camper because that'll be the, all the ice I need. But also just be a whole lot of nothing. And I suspect that's what it'll be. I really should hit the twigs up too along the way. Don't have many. No, can't use my walking cane because we're so wet. Uh, yeah, let's dry off a bit. I don't need the grass. And we'll use our book and such. I could start digging these up, but. It's not my priority at this very moment in time. I don't have the torch anymore, so I can't burn to dry off. Alright, so nearest wormhole. We already have mapped mapped we don't have that one mapped. Um Fingers crossed that it doesn't take me back towards base. I'm trying to go far away from base. <laughs> can't seem to catch a break there. Big torch. Twigs here, I'll take. And what I'm going to do is burn you down and dry off very quickly. There we go. Faster! Faster! I'm watching the little the down arrow on the wetness meter. Faster! <laughs> Close enough. Close enough. Back to the cane. So, more twigs. I'll hit them up along the way. And let's see, where does this wormhole take me? In this wormhole, please. Take me somewhere useful. Unlike most of the wormholes I've found so far. I mean, they're, they're kind of meh. I'd, mm, what I wouldn't do for a close wormhole to like take me over to the Mac Tusks and such. That'd be sweet. Mainly just because it's so far away from base. It would make it such a really useful one. That sounds very bad. <laughs> that is the spooter ring. Yeah. <laughs> That's all the silk I ever need. However, now we're pretty close to the ice. I don't require that silk right now. I can take this stuff, though. These are resources that I don't mind having extras of. And we're close to the fairy ring, right? It was over here. Yeah, up there. We can go hit up a bunch of extra green caps. Not that I don't already have tons of them in the ice box at home. Excuse me, spiders. Ooh, what do I, what's this spear at? Is this the 1%? Yeah. <laughs> just to hug this booter a little bit there. Just just, to, just an easy bit. It, it's just a love tap. <laughs> That's what I'm going with. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. It was just a love tap, Spooter. Okay. All right, uh, let's see. We're coming up to the ice. I can maybe finally make this a dream. Get that second fling out, or better yet, just have it in the crock pot for an emergency cooldown method. Eat some ice, you never know. It can come in useful. It can really come in handy. Couple burnt trees, I'm okay there. I mean, I could get in, yeah, burn some more, get some drying racks up and running. I would not complain about that at all. Tall bird, looks like another small bird died. There's another morsel there. Could whoop that tall bird's ass. Uh, I got plenty of food. And I got plenty of meat too at home, so I think I'll leave it be. As much as I hate tall birds, I, I've got an objective right now and I gotta stick to it. I don't think you have any inventory slots left, bud. Not really. 
can't even take that from you. Okay. Ice it is. Glacier is what you got for me. Extremely dense ice indeed. Now gimme. Okay. Three is good. And got more over here. So I think I had four at home. So we're looking seven total right now. Let's keep going. Obviously while I'm over here, I'm going to pretty much get everything. I think that'd be foolish of me not to. And I may not be able to see, but I can toggle between the torch. <laughs> Next one, north. Not worried about sanity loss right now. I have to use these green caps. I need a reason, you know? Don't let them go to waste. Nice. There you go, bud. And up north we go. Still gotta use the silk that I have. Make that bug net. Thankfully, the biome that we're in, our base. Yeah, my ro stupid rock. I'm trying to use a torch, and the rock was like, no, focus on me. That could go badly. But anyway, we have tons of fireflies at home. I gotta, I gotta make that miner hat. And it's right here. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Yep, you got more than enough ice to do what I need to do now. I love it. I like it. And I could also make another thermal stone if I wanted to. Not a bad idea. Because we could also leave some in the backpack. You know, for the backpack thermal stone strats. Which, I mean, I can still do the same thing with the ice. I can, or, well, the ice box and the thermal stones. I can put two cold thermal stones, sec stand next to an endo, and cool off. But not having the umbrella is kind of kicking the dick. That's my favorite thing to use to prevent insulation. There are other items. But that is my favorite. Torch is wearing out the rain. Uh, I could, I guess I'll mine this. I have to make another pick, though. Is it worth it? Ah, it's not really worth it, but... I'll turn that into another thermal I needed to. Ah. I can take that out of inventory. That works. Close enough, right? There you go, man. So, the green caps, obviously I have room for it, let's go hit them up, and thankfully they have a lightning rod protecting them, so lightning will do nothing to my green caps. <laughs> they should all be back now. Yeah, buddy, I could totally dig them up, but I don't know, do I want to stay around here, or considering it's day 19 going into day 20, I think I want to just get the fuck out of here. I think I really want to just get, just get out of here, that'd be a great idea. Going insane would not be bad either. I gotta get that nightmare fuel going. But living logs, they're always what's holding me back. I don't see what you're even remotely salty about. So here's that set piece again. Oh. But why, why am I. Why does this not happen to me when I'm WX? Why does it happen to me as other characters? The lightning strikes. I'll never understand. Wormhole, there's one down here, and I bet you any money it just takes me back. That's, that's a useless. That's a useless freaking wormhole. I bet you any money that's all it does, too. So I don't see another one. Uh, I really don't know. I don't think that wormhole's even worth testing. I bet it's linked to the one right beside it. That's just a waste of everybody's time. Get a few extra twigs, and let's go home, and let me see. Double thermal stones in the ice box will be enough to get me going. Putting an endo in the center of base is something I still have not done, but I have one pre-crafted. And I have the ability to make ever so many more, so I will do that. Now let's just cut through here because this is unexplored. What have we got? What have we? Not much? Not much. And then the fireflies thing. That's looking more useful now than ever. I like that. We'll go home and we'll do that too. The miner hat, of course, follows suit. Hey, pig, what you doing, man? We, we do have to get this ice in the ice box before it starts melting. Or craft it up into what we need, which we do have the two doodads on the ground, and we do have the gears, so I can instantly do that. Just gotta get my ass home. Rain's the concern now. Uh, I could dry off. I could. But I could also just plow through the sanity hit and use the cane to get home quicker. And dry off there. Eh, not a bad idea. It's just water. Yeah, it's just water. Just a little bit of sanity, which I have the green caps that are going bad anyway, so I gotta use them. Gotta make do. I gotta make use of them. 
Otherwise, I'd feel terrible. Run! Run, Wicker! Why don't you have a book for this? Why don't you have a book for making you run faster? Hmm? Hmm? Wicker? Did you think about that one? Did I activate that touchstone? I mean, I've seen it before, but I've seen the pigheads. I didn't even activate it. I saw the pigheads earlier, and I thought nothing of it. <laughs> Let's hammer it down. You know why? Twigs. Not even the pigskin. Not even kidding. I want the extra twigs for the crockpot. There we go. And the future drying racks. And I can take pretty much all of this. I can't take any more pigskin, though. Which is kind of funny. We're that well off on pigskin. Excellent. And back on this road we go! Faster, 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 faster. Get your butt home, Wicker. You got stuffs to do. You got stuff to build, things to prototype, a base to prep. Summer is right around the corner in two days, and your base is looking abysmal, in my opinion. How dare you, Wicker? <laughs> Why you no build faster? Why you no build faster? I don't know. I don't, I don't like this world, Jen. I do and I don't. We've got some really great things, but I didn't get that really big rocky biome with everything in it, which sucks. That's one of my favorite things to get. Because it has all of your, all the resources you will ever need. Like all the gold, all the flint, all the rocks. You just go to town, mine up everything. Like green cap, sure. Yeah, the pigs, I can't live with these guys forever. I'll have to start butchering some of them. They will get in the way. They will turn into were pigs, and that will not be fun. Uh, the cut stone, I won't need for this. Let's see, drop the hammer. Find them silk stacks. Let me make the net to have it pre-crafted or to have it pre-made that and ice nice okay extra ice goes bye bye and let me just use the berry voila more meaty balls more meaty balls and do i have the yes i do so that's what four or five four away so right there should be Mufflingo. Absolutely. Okay, got way more room to work with. Can put a ton of drying racks over there. Can start moving crops around. Not feeling bad about it. Good, 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 good. Okay, so the fireflies now. Uh, meatballs, we just eat. Berries, hell yeah. <laughs> Let's build up this supply. Put this in the ice box. And I could start bringing grass and twigs back home. Um, so you got the double thermal stones. I gotta put the endo fire pit down as well. And I, that means I want to pre craft another one. Which also means I want. Oh, let me put this away too. This is the third one, right? No, this is the second one. I'll just combine the stacks. Okay, so put that there. The rod I only had in there so that they didn't eat it. And I'll leave it in. Actually, no, I'll put it up here. And I need to make two more. Because I need to make two doodads. I should pre-craft that lightning rod. I'll do that. And I should have everything I need to make another one of you. Okay. Examine the flingos. Oh, why she says nothing to see. Meh. Right there is fine. Alright guys, it is time to wrap it up here though. That is episode 6 of Lots of Giants. Um, most of this world is explored, yeah. I mean, there's nothing down there. No, no, no branches, no connections. There's nothing this way unless this turns into a huge biome, which I kinda doubt. I think that set piece is just sort of tucked in there. I got the ice that I required. The only real other area that's unexplored is the desert, but I don't think it's gonna lead anywhere. There's a good bit of cactus in this one, which I do like, I can't appreciate. Now, some are rolling around the corner, the double thermal stones will be helpful. Umbrella to mitigate some of the heat will be nice. I do need to get the miner hat, and but having the chilled amulet is definitely going to make a huge difference. Definitely going to be super useful. But guys, wrapping up here, episode 6, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.